today was really good. The, uh, if we can have, how many more practices, how many more days we got till? Uh, 31 days. 31 days. If we can have ever how many practices, that means about 20, 21 or whatever it is. Just like today, we'll be as ready as we can be and that's, that's all you can ask. But uh, I thought uh, the uh, moving around and the tempo and working together, that's uh, another big thing that you just can't take for granted. But uh, we like to work offense versus defense and uh, getting them to work together and not uh, end up with a little scuffle going on or a fight or whatever. Uh, sometimes, uh, but our guys work together great. And so I think the offense and defense got better. With Michael Vick coming back, uh, how important was it for him to address the team and just have his presence here at day one? I don't know, but Pete, tell me what you, will you tell me? The number of tickets we sold? So, uh, yeah, we went from uh, the start of practice, we had about 500 season tickets left, and we're down about 200 from the time that the Mike stepped onto uh, campus here. See, some people said, okay, they got excited about Michael being back, but I think it's my new highway out here. <laughs> I mean, I swear to goodness. And then uh, I think that people are catching on to the toll booth. I think we'll get that done, and retirement will be good, boys. How much is the toll? <laughs> I haven't said that yet. Coach, can you talk running back? It may be more for some people than others. <laughs> Media. Yeah, yeah I, I like it, though. I like McMillan. Just watching him out there today. Uh, you know, I mean, I, I, I think he'll bring something to the table. You know, uh, J.C. Coleman uh, is a difference maker. And, and uh, you know, he's... Uh, I, always, I used to worry about him. I think I've told you guys this before. I, I worried about him as in protection, you know, just uh, running inside. But, I mean, he can do it all. He did it in the bowl game. He did it down in the stretch. And I just looking out at him out there today, and, uh, you know, he's big time. You know, he's a little fella, but he's big time. So, uh, you know, I, I like our running back situation. I, 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 think, we're, I think we're very talented at that position. Now we got to stay healthy. You know, last year this time we thought we were good and then we lost about four or five, so we got to stay healthy. Feel great, feel good, uh, eager to get going. Um, you know, it's, I've told people it's the best I've ever had it uh, as far as uh, uh, coaching staff that I uh, got great confidence in. I walked up here today and uh, actually sat in a chair. Now, I've never done that in practice, but sat in a chair and watched practice for a few minutes. I said, how good can this be? <laughs> so, uh, good view of the uh, deal, you know, this new facility. So, uh, now nah, it's good. Uh, it's, uh, I, I'm, I'm eager to, for us to put this team together and, and see where it goes. You know, injuries is always a key deal, but uh, I like the team, I like the leadership. Uh, I like a lot of things right now. So, you know, it's never been better. I tell you with uh, Kendall Fuller and Faison and then Chuck Clark kind of being in that mix too, that corner, I mean, it just doesn't get any better. You're talking about guys with some height, guys that are smart, guy that plays smart, uh, tough, I mean, it just, doesn't get any better, and this level is as good as good as it can be. So, uh, just uh, you know, like those guys. You know, between the Fullers and the Edmonds, you know, I mean, we we've, we've been blessed here at Virginia Tech because uh, you know to have the, those two families and moms and dads and the kids that's going through here. Uh, I don't think I've ever had a, one of those kids in my office for. Um, for discipline, you know. Uh, the only time I've ever had them in there is to call them in and tell them they, congratulations, they did something good, you know. I mean, they're just great kids, and it all starts at home and, you know, with mom and dad.